Hey guys, in this video I want to share with you guys a very cool app that I've been using for the last couple weeks already and it's called Automatelt. Yes, that's a very weird name, but it's a very cool app. Um, it's an app that lets you um, create triggers and actions for your phone. Like for example, uh, if you're if you're like me that at home I turn off I turn on Wi-Fi, but I turn off Bluetooth or GPS. But when I'm in the car, I turn off Wi-Fi and I turn on Bluetooth and all that. It, all those type of triggers can done be done automatically without you even doing it on your own by letting the app do it. And now I'm going to show you guys how it works. Uh, you can access it by tapping on the app or you could access it by tapping over here on your notification. Uh, one thing that I really like uh, compared to other apps that do the same thing is that this app is very, very user friendly. Um, first of all, you got your rules over here. These are your rules already that's already in your phone and these are the rules market. Uh, you could get m uh, more rules without you even creating it from the market which that's one feature that I totally love. Uh, let's go ahead here so you guys can see for example what I'm talking about. Um, here it's like a market because um, a lot of people share. You can share your, um, your rules, the rules that you create. You could go ahead and share them. For example, you got latest, you got top rating and you got hot rules. Uh, for example, over here, uh, you can put, um, there's a rule that says Wi-Fi off, not home. So that's a very popular uh, rule there. Over here it says um, unmute by SMS. Um, over here, you can click over here, my home cell equals Wi-Fi on. Leave my home cell equals Wi-Fi off. That's a very cool one. It's very very easy. Where is my phone? GPS off when map is closed. Battery full. Disconnect chargers. Uh, it's very easy to just apply one. For example, click on that and download the rule. When you download the rule, uh, you can go ahead from right here. It says um, battery level is 100%. Speak text. Battery fully charged. Disconnect the charger. So let's go ahead and save it. Uh, now the rule has a, a success successfully installed. Now once you download a uh, rule from the market, it's going to be right here in my rules. So right here you're going to see I have 10 rules, 4 that are active and 6 that are disabled. Let's go ahead and tap on that. Um, over here you can see the one that I turned off. Which one was it? Let me see. Wi-Fi off when we're leaving home. My home equals cell. My car over here. Battery full. Disconnect charger. That's the one that I just downloaded. You could tap there. If you want to turn it off, you could just turn over here off and it will be over here in disabled uh, um, disabled um, rules. Uh, very easy to create one as well. Look here, you can see all the rules. Here you can see the active rules. Like right now I have in-car Bluetooth on. Let's go tap over here. And you can see uh, the specific actions. Trigger, the device is in a vehicle, such as a car. Set Bluetooth adapter status to Bluetooth on. Uh, that's very cool because I could have my Bluetooth off at home, right? So when I get into my car and start driving, the Bluetooth will automatically turn on because um, based on the GPS or the 3G, it identifies that the phone is moving um, at certain speeds and it automatically turns it on, which is a very, very convenient. I've been using that nonstop. Over here, I have another rule that says my home cell equals Wi-Fi on. So it says over here, device is connected to one of the cells defined in custom location, set Wi-Fi adapter status to Wi-Fi enabled. So that means when I'm getting close to my home, um, when the phone connects automatically to one of the cell towers that are right near to my home, um, it will automatically trigger my Wi-Fi to get turned on, which is an awesome feature as well because by the time I get into my garage, my, my Wi-Fi already is on. That's an awesome feature. So over here, I got Wi-Fi off when leaving home, and it does the same thing but the opposite. So like see right here, outside of existing proximity region of 200 meters around 
sampling rate 10 minutes using fine and coarse accuracy uh, set Wi-Fi adapter status to Wi-Fi disabled that's another cool feature when I leave my home it will automatically turn off once I pass the 200 meters from my home or from my tower which is very very cool okay so let's go ahead and show you guys how easy it is to create one rule um, let's go ahead and click here um, here let's go ahead like you see right here you got common rules common triggers more triggers and over here you got lock triggers which you can unlock it by buying the app which is $1.99 uh, totally worth it I'm will, total, um, will be buying it um, over here one of the triggers that rules that I'm missing is uh, Bluetooth device disconnect trigger uh, specific Bluetooth device is disconnected that's a, a trigger that I want to do so let's go ahead and click here and like you can see here it will automatically show you all the devices that are connected or saved to my cell phone like for example I got the Moga Pro the my Sonata my vehicle Moga Pro HID and my headphones Motorola S305 so right now the most one that I use is my car so I'm gonna go ahead um, select this car right here Sonata and it says right here trigger activate when disconnecting from this device so when it disconnects from this device because when I turn off the vehicle I want the Bluetooth to turn off without me looking for it um, go ahead click next now I'm gonna have to select the action let's go ahead of course I want it to turn off so let's go ahead and look for the action to turn off okay so right here set Bluetooth action state turn Bluetooth adapter on or off let's go ahead and click on that I want the adapter to turn off the Bluetooth to turn off so like, like you see right here you can see the trigger which is the Bluetooth device dis disconnected from my Sonata uh, set Bluetooth adapter status to off or you could tur go ahead, turn it to on let's go ahead and put it off let's go next um, here you go name it uh, car mm -hmm. Bluetooth off uh, car Bluetooth off you can name it whatever you want um, here you could put a delay for example if I wanted to turn off like one minute later or a couple seconds later you could put put that as well but right now I'm just gonna leave it like that default as it is no delayed whatever and click save now the rule have been saved and let's click over here car Bluetooth off yes it is off so that's it so if you want to disable it you could go ahead and click on if you want to edit the rule you could go ahead and edit uh, delete the rule you could upload the rule you could share this rule with the market and people can go ahead and download it and that's it so like you see there I got now when I get uh, uh, when I get off my car when I turn off the car the Bluetooth will automatically turn off when I'm in the car the Bluetooth will automatically turn on when I'm at home when I get close to my home the Wi-Fi will turn on and when I leave my home the Wi-Fi will turn off so that's the idea of this app and I like it because it makes it easy it makes it, it makes it easy to to learn um, the best thing of it is the market because from the market if you don't really know how to create it if it's confusing for you you could just go ahead to the market and download your own download it from people that are doing the same rules as you remember everybody uses their phone different ways but there's always somebody that has the same uh, demands as you um, here you can go to settings and from here you can go ahead and customize a couple things like for example if you don't want it to show over here you could disable that and a couple more things over here uh, proximity radius from your home you can set it up to a hundred for for these type of locations uh, there's a lot of things you could do here but I'm not going to go into that because um, honestly um, this using the market and creating your own you will have a great experience and this app makes it very good and like I said you could go ahead and download it for free you could use a couple triggers if that's all you need and if you need a lot more triggers believe me you will want a lot more triggers once you start learning how this thing works uh, you will buy it it's only $1.99 which for me it's totally worth it and I will be getting it too because you could create different kind of triggers that you can get for free as well so guys I hope you guys like the video let me know what you guys think about this app this was Automa Telt awesome app for Android